is your video on how to make part four. So let's compare it to part three. If you guys have already made part three, look, it only has a little bit of a tail that sticks out back here. So basically, we're just going to remake three and add a little tail on the bottom, on the bottom right. Okay. Back here, you can't really tell if there's one in the left, but there's not. How do we know that? Because look, the top view of our orthographic projection, there's not one over here. Also, you can kind of see a gap back there, so you know it's not right there either. So basically, it's part three, and then we're going to add a part that sticks out the back right. Okay, so I'm going to go to block four. I'm going to go to my top view. I'm going to sketch on the top. And remember what we did on part three. We're going to draw a block, make it one by one. Then we're going to start one right here. And it goes to that. And we're going to say that that needs to be a one. And then that right here, make that a one. And now we're going to go right here, from here to here. Make that a one. Look, that's the bottom of part three already. So all we have to do, add that little tail that sticks out the back right from the, the way I'm looking at it. If you drew it a different way, it could possibly be the other side. But right here, it's going to come out the back. So I'm going to add that right here. Make that an inch. Finish my sketch. Extrude. What am I extruding? The whole sketch one. So that's the bottom of part four. Now all I gotta do is put that little head that sticks out in the middle. So back to my top view. Sketch on top of the shape we made. Rectangle. It should start in that corner right here. Go to that corner right here. And then go to that one right there. Let go. So we have our square. And it's a bunch of ones. Which is perfect. Check mark. Extrude. What are we extruding? The whole sketch too. Because that's all it was. One inch. Ta-da. Part four is now completed.